Raging Neil Warnock branded the postponement of Cardiff's promotion shootout at Derby, scandalous, after another triumph for health and safety snowflakes. And the Bluebirds manager stirred the pot by hinting darkly that postponement suited the faltering Rams because of an injury crisis which left manager Gary Rowett with only 10 fit senior players at training last Friday. If anybody in the ivory towers at Sky Sports or the Football League is listening, this farce should be the death knell of 12 noon kickoffs to suit TV schedules where long-distance fans are required to travel 160 miles after setting off at daft o'clock. Around 2,600 Cardiff supporters were halfway to Pride Park when news filtered through of the match being shunted into the pending tray. The Beast from the East Part 2 prevented the game from going ahead, Image, Rex, Shattershock, Derby were not responsible for the decision by safety officials, but Warnock was furious his high-flying Bluebirds were denied the chance to open 10-point gap on Fulham and Aston Villa in race for automatic promotion. He said, it's scandalous, an absolute disgrace. We could lodge an official complaint with the Football League, but what's the point? They would only refer us to the statement about spectator safety and it will be case dismissed. Although I'm bitterly disappointed, I'm not overly surprised after I heard Gary's remarks earlier in the week about their injury crisis. Warnock was not impressed with the decision, Image, Rex, Shattershock, Cardiff's players arrived at, Pride Park, Image, Rex, Shattershock, but we were raring to go because we've been on a great run, so to come here and find it's perfectly playable leaves a sour taste. Even some of the Derby fans think it's a stitch up. But in a way, you can't blame them, you wouldn't want to play us at the moment, would you? It never crossed my mind that the game might be called off until we got a call in our hotel from someone at Derby, I don't know who it was, to say it was postponed on safety grounds. Safety grounds? I can't accept that, the pitch is perfect, the areas around the stadium have been cleared and our team coach made it to Pride Park from our overnight hotel in the middle of the countryside without a problem. Tom Lawrence is among Derby's injury list, image, PA, Tom Huddlestone was sent off last weekend, image, Getty Images Europe, there was nobody here from Derby when we came to collect the players' boots which the kit man delivered to the ground last night, I think they are embarrassed. I thought we might have had a phone call from certain people or the management but we've had nothing at all. All the staff here are embarrassed when you walk in through the doors. This is proper football weather, a perfect day to get stuck in. It's a travesty that we aren't going to be playing in it. Cardiff, who have taken 29 points from a possible 33, are still 8-1 on with bookies William Hill to win the 8th promotion of Warnock's managerial career. Derby, seven games without a win, were one of only two clubs to suffer postponement in all four divisions in the FA Cup at the weekend. League 1 Gillingham were the other casualties. The Rams kept their merchandise superstore open from 10am to 4pm.